students today i'm here with another amazing olympiad question so let's take a look if 3 root 5 plus square root of 125 is equal to 17.88 then what will be the value of square root of 80 plus 6 root 5 now this question involves a lot of roots yeah this looks tricky but let's see how simply we can solve this just by making use of the basic concepts that we have already learned So we are given that three root five plus square root of one twenty five is equals to seventeen point eight eight. We have to build up some relationship so that I get root eighty plus six root five. So what we can do here is this three root five. Let's write it as it is. Square root of one twenty five. I can write one twenty five as five times five times five is equals to seventeen point eight eight as it is. Now we know that here a pair is formed. So this could be written as three root five. This five comes out. Right, because a pair is formed here. That's how you find out the square roots. Right, is equals to seventeen point eight eight. Now three root five plus five root five. I know a lot of students get stuck here. How to add numbers and roots? So you see that root five, root five, they both have that. Right. So root five would be common here. I mean that will come. We just have to add these numbers over here. Three and five. That's going to be eight. That's how we add numbers that involves square roots. So eight root five is going to be equals to seventeen point eight eight. Now that means I can say that root five would be equal to seventeen point eight eight upon eight, right? And on simplifying this, you will get two point two three five. So we have got the value of root five from here. So this is the actual value of root five, right? Now what I can do here is simply I can put this value here. But first I have to simplify this. This root eighty, this root eighty over here, this could be written as root eighty is nothing. That's basically sixteen times five is eighty, right? Plus Six root five. Now root sixteen. This root is common for both of them. It is for sixteen as well as five. Root sixteen is nothing. That's four. And root five remains as it is. Plus six root five. Now four root five. We know how to add numbers involving square roots. So four root five plus six root five. That will give us ten root five. So ten root five. Now simply what I'll do is I'll substitute the value of root five over here. That's going to be equals to ten times two point two three five. Since we are multiplying with ten, so we will shift the decimal towards right. Since it is multiplication, only one place towards the right. Since we are multiplying with ten over here, that's going to be twenty two point three five. That would be the final result for this question. See, this question looks so tricky because generally what happens is when we see square roots, roots and all in the question, we get scared. Oh my God, this is going to be difficult. But We solved it with so much ease, right? Now you can also try out questions like this, and if you have any doubts, you can always leave your doubts in the comment section below.